Hello there, Gemini. This is Gypsy Spirit here with you, ready to give you your January reading. Um, there's, I just drew your cards, and I'm doing something a little different than what I normally do. Um, I, whenever I have somebody local come to sit down in my, at my table with me and I do a reading for them, I always use my map cards, my angel cards, and my flower cards, and incorporate my tarot deck with those cards and so that's what I'm doing for you today Gemini and uh, I drew these cards and immediately picked up what was going on and um, uh, let's just get started um, your first card is the moonlight this is from the um, map deck and it's looking to me like um, times of the essence and you've been uh, trying to get insight and clarity because there's so many things swirling around you that you can't keep up. Um, there's some changes that you know you need to make in your life and you're just not sure which direction to go in. You know, it's like everything is coming at you so fast, Gemini. Things are, things are moving really fast. And, uh, you know, I have the world card. There's been a time when you felt trapped and that you couldn't really think uh, about um, anything in the future because you just, like the, the Moonlight card says, that you may have even spent a lot of nights awake trying to figure things out and, and what you needed to do next in your life and, and, and where to go and how to go about it. And it has... It, I'm just seeing like sleepless nights for you here in the past. But the world card is a, it's a, a card of movement. So there's a chapter in your life that's ending and there's a new chapter starting. And that's what's kind of got you, you know, going uh, in a little frenzy because as you see this chapter in your life ending, you're wondering, well, what? What's next? You know, where do I go from here? And so, um, it's all good, but it's like you, you've got new challenges in front of you, and you're just not sure how to, how to move forward with those challenges. Not that you can't, but you're trying to figure out the best way to go about it. Um, your next card is the Eight of Swords. Now, Swords is about conflict within your mind, you know, thoughts, ideas. Um, it, it represents to me conflict, but it came to me in reverse which is telling me that, um, you know, all for, for some, you, you felt trapped. Whatever your situation was, you felt like you were trapped in it. And the world card here, I'll put these two cards together. It's like you have your world card here, which is telling you there's a new chapter in your life starting. Um, there, it may be a new job, new relationship, new home, uh, maybe a new child in your family or something. There's something new. But whatever it is, there was a time where you felt trapped, but now there, that feeling of being trapped is, is gone. Um, you no longer feel that. But with that being said, Gemini, you have the Ace of Wands. Now this is what it looks like upright, but when I pulled it, it was in reverse. So it's telling me that um, there's some new, being in this, this new chapter of your life, you're having some um, concerns about where, which way to go, um, how to, you know, you know, what road to take. You want to take this road or you take that road. Um, you know, there's there's a lot of things that may be unclear to you right now, and so I would. This is why I got the flower card, which is this uh, lotus. This is chakra clearing. So this card says. By clearing your chakras, you open yourself to a profound wisdom. So what this really boils down to, Gemini, is just there's been a massive confusion in your mind. Um, you are starting a new chapter in your life. You are freeing yourself from whatever held you down in the past. But you're still unclear as to where to go next, what to do next. And that's why the Ace of Wands is in reverse, because you just don't have that clarity quite yet. And so that's why the Chakra, uh, the Lotus 
card is advising you to clear your chakras and you will get the wisdom that you need. Um, but I have a beautiful angel card for you and that is Shanti. And she's, she has a beautiful message for you, Gemini. She says, I am the angel of peace. I bring you new tranquility and a smoother road ahead. So there you go. I mean, it's all about clearing out um, the foggy thoughts. You know, you're not able to see the forest or the trees is what I was getting. And um, it's left you with sleepless nights and worry. And it's, um, it's telling you, your Shanti, your, your angel card is telling you, don't, you don't need to feel that way because it's going to get better. It's all about just clearing your head a little bit. And it's understandable. I mean, we've had, um, you know, we just got over the holidays. The holidays are always crazy, you know. <laughs> um, so you're going to be fine. I mean, you're in a, there's, there's a new chapter in your life and you're starting over and it's all going to be good. So happy uh, 2019 for you, uh, Gemini, and I hope this helps. I am starting to do, uh, I, I've lived in the home that I'm in for um, about three months and it's an old home it's from it was built in 1937 my grandmother who used to read tarot many years ago she always lived like within an out within a mile's reach of this house and uh, when I got this house my grandmother came to me and told me that she wanted to read tarot that she was gonna live in this house with me and she wanted to read tarot and so I, I've done some personal readings with local friends and family and, and my clients and stuff who have come to my home and and she's read with that she's read the tarot along with me and so now my grandmother and I are offering you a personal reading um, and to get that you have to go to my website at www.gypsyspiritcharleston.com and I'll have all the information for you down in the description of this video and you can follow that but um, I normally charge $55 for my readings but we have a special uh, Dorothy May and I do Dorothy May is, was my grandmother so we are offering um, these readings at $25 for this month only um, but again you can get all the details and everything by looking at the description if you like this video this um, reading please hit the like button and if you'd like to subscribe to my channel, please hit the subscribe button and that way you get a notice every time I put out a video. Thank you so much for tuning in and Gemini, just hang in there. It's going to get better for you. All right. Bye-bye.